What I really love about the elf from the best damn thing is that Avril Lavigne taps into her feminine side. In her earlier days, she was certainly not known for that. She was known as being a tomboy. In many ways, she has done some of the same things. All her albums have lots of great emotion. In her earlier days, even when she was a tomboy, she did have that side. It didn't come out as much. For example, she would say she's a hopeless romantic. And I even remember reading something recently that she was always saying that she was looking forward to her wedding. So it was there. It was dormant. The song, The Best Damn Thing, has some lines that would make anal retentive, uptight feminists cringe. And I like that. I used to associate it with, with those types of people. And they would get so offended by things such as one guy scolding a feminist for burping. And he said, that sounds real attractive. And then she got angry. I don't want to be attractive. The lines that would make the feminist cringe are, I hate it when a guy doesn't get the door when I told him about it yesterday and the day before. I hate it when a guy doesn't get a tab. And I have to pull my money out and that looks bad. Perhaps the femininity is exaggerated. She feels a need to tap into it because she didn't so much earlier, but who cares? It works for me. It's a great album. The song, The Best Damn Thing, is great. And she is in her best element when she's embracing her femininity.